We're back on the camera, baby. That means I couldn't. I took that picture. Can you see? I took that picture. It's a Monday at Crumble. Can we do this? Or are the boxes gonna close? The boxes are gonna close. So I got mom's recipe, which is a classic. Love it. I've tried it before. And then this is the pink velvet. We love it when it doesn't focus pink velvet so i think i'm gonna try the pink velvet first and then the mom's recipe because i've tried the, the mom's recipe before and i absolutely love it and i don't think i've ever tried the pink velvet where's the app um let's see pink velvet putting the phone there served warm this is the pink velvet it is supposed to be served warm a velvet cake batter cookie topped with a layer of vanilla cream cheese frosting okay there's the cream cheese frosting and pink velvet crumbs it does have pink velvet crumbs so i'm guessing what they do is when they bake it they crumble up a cookie and they put it on top that's what it looks like um so let's give it a try it is very soft in the center my my dad just got my car cleaned and I'm here dropping stuff everywhere. So, Halo, this is the cookie. Let's give it a try. It's pretty good. It does kind of taste like cake batter. It does kind of taste like, well, it is a cake batter cookie. But I like any cookie that has cream cheese. Any cookie that has cream cheese frosting, I love. I love cream cheese frosting. The balance between the cookie, though, and the cream cheese frosting is really good. But I don't... I love... I love the cream cheese frosting. You got me... But the cookie, I don't... I'm not a big fan of it. I don't know. I'm not a big fan of the cookie. The cream, the cream cheese frosting, though, is phenomenal. I love that, but I don't, I don't know. Probably give that a 7.5 out of 10. Now we're gonna do mom's recipe. Mom's, mama's recipe. Let me just take it out of the box. Oh my goodness. And we're dropping stuff everywhere. So mom's recipe, a taste of home, a chunky oatmeal cookie packed with semi-sweet chocolate toffee, which I love the balance of it, and peanut butter chips all sprinkled with the dash of sea salt. There is sea salt on here, but I don't see. They like sprinkled it more in one spot than like the entire cookie. But let's give this a try. And it is served warm. Should I just break this in half? I'm gonna break it in half. You guys can't even see that, but there it is. Okay, so. What's not to love about this cookie? I think they changed the recipe of it though because I don't remember them having peanut butter chips in it. I remember the toffee, but no peanut butter. It's still pretty good, but right now, I'm getting more of a peanut butter flavor than a toffee. When the last time I tried it, I got more of a toffee flavor, which I loved. Um, so I gotta go. I gotta finish up this video because my camera's about to overheat. I give the mom's recipe cookie a 8.5 out of 10. They kind of changed the recipe a little. Does not really taste the same. I really liked the other one before. I still like this one, but I just got a lot of peanut butter in mine. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Don't forget to subscribe to my vlog channel because the Taylor Swift concert will be up in about two days. I added something to it, so now I have to edit the thing that I added. But yeah, it'll be up in like one or two days. Peace. Can this hear me? Hello? Hello? Testing, testing, I don't know.
back in the car and I cried like a baby coming home from the bar. <laughs> but it wasn't true. I don't want to keep secrets just to keep you and I. Yeah, it's working.